As we approach the breeding season, there's a lot of interest in using sex semen. How can you maximize the chance of successful use of sex semen in your herd? First, the bulls. Pick the highest EBI bulls that are available. These are going to give you long-term genetic gain in your herd. And second, use a team of at least five bulls. Some bulls have a big reduction in fertility after sorting, but we have no way of knowing in advance who those bulls are. So use a large team. In terms of the females, heifers are the, the first choice because these are the highest fertility animals in the herd and also generally the highest EBI animals in the herd. The heifers should have reached target live weight and be in good body condition score. And you should know from seeing these animals that they're already cycling regularly before the breeding season uh, commences. You'll also need to use some sex semen on cows and you should target the best fertility cows in the herd. So some simple rules of thumb. The cows should be in parities one to four. They must be at least 50 days in milk on the day of AI. They should be in good body condition score, at least three. And again, you should know that they're already cycling regularly and importantly, that they are free of postpartum disorders and uterine disease. When should we use sex semen? So if you're going to use it, you need to restrict the usage to the first three weeks of the breeding season and use it, if possible, within the first 10 days. When do we inseminate cows? So if it's based on observed heat, the recommendation is to inseminate cows at 14 to 20 hours after heat onset. It is possible to use fixed time AI and successful results can be achieved. It is costly, but it does mitigate some of the risk of using sex semen. It does this by facilitating targeted usage of sex semen on high fertility animals on mating start date, such that those animals will repeat by day 21 of the breeding season and hence no reduction in, in no, no deterioration in calving pattern. So the last part of it is on the day of AI, the straw handling on the day of AI. So it's important that the sex semen straws are uh, sorted or organized into, into a single goblet. Thaw only two straws at a time. So you might get away with more with conventional semen, but sex semen is a, is a more fragile product. Thaw the straws at 35 to 37 degrees for 45 seconds. Load the straws into pre-warmed AI guns and keep those AI guns warm. Deposit semen into the uterine body as normal and complete the inseminations within five minutes.